Those cuts are part of a major slashing to the city budget that saw the Portland Fire Bureau take a big hit. Amy Frazier is live now in Southeast Portland. And Amy, starting July 1st, that's what we're talking about here. Portland Fire will no longer have a dive team. Dive team. Yeah, that's right, Kelly. Uh, Portland firefighters will still respond to emergencies that are out here in the water. In fact, they do have what's called a surface water rescue team. However, only the sheriff's office now will send divers, and that can take some time. Did she actually jump? We were with the Portland Fire and Rescue Dive Team in 2009 as they responded to a call of someone missing underwater. What are we getting on our depth? Starting July 1st, you won't see Portland firefighters doing this kind of underwater rescue effort anymore. City budget cuts have sunk the dive program. The situations where they're submerged, we won't be able to um, provide that dive rescue service. It is something the Multnomah County Sheriff's Office dive team will continue to do. But while firefighter divers were on duty, the Sheriff's Office dive team operates on call. Because your dive team is on call, will it take them longer to get there than it would have taken Portland Fire in some cases? If we're on duty and we are training close to the area or whatever, it could be five minutes, but it could be an hour, hour and a half, depending on where the, uh, where the location of our personnel are responding to that incident. Portland Fire and Sheriff's Office divers have typically both responded to the same emergencies. Right now we have an agreement that Portland Fire handled that first hour of time, which is what they call the golden hour, where theoretically someone that's under the water could be brought back. Starting July 1st, deputy divers will be the only divers responding. The question is, in some cases, will it be too late? As far as our response time goes, we go to work right when we get there. We don't believe there's, there's going to be a significant impact for us. We're going to respond, and we're going to respond in kind. There's still the rescue efforts that are ongoing, but our dive team will get there and go to work as soon as we can. Now, divers with the sheriff's office are very dedicated at what they do. At the same time, Portland firefighters tell me that in the future, they really hope they'll be able to get this dive team back. Reporting live in Southeast Portland, Amy Frazier, Point Six News.